Hey everyone, this is uh, Sukage, formerly Fujikage. Uh, please check my previous videos of uh, why the name change. Uh, you guys should be all caught up by now. But uh, anyways, moving around right along. Uh, my last video that I just uploaded uh, just a moment ago was voting for the new headband symbol of uh, the, the ninja headband symbol for Tidal Wave. So I'm going online. Naruto headband symbol. Art picture. And let's make certain that uh, I'm not copying anyone because I pride myself on being original. Let's go, let's go down the list. Let's, uh, let's start here. So it doesn't matter if it's from the Naruto show, or if it's from the manga, the Naruto manga book, or if it's fan-made. It doesn't matter. My, I want to make certain that I'm not copying anyone. So let's see if uh, anyone has come up with the symbol of my last video that I made. Mist. Mist almost looks kind of similar, but they got four of those squiggly lines. And it is a water-based nation. And in my story that I'm going to be creating, uh, that I also write in my private chat rooms, uh, the majority of the ninjas that make up Tidal Wave are uh, basically escapees from the Mist Village. For instance, the two most notable ones was uh, Zabaza Momochi and Haku. Uh, I believe, or... I believe that's how you say that dude's name, and the two uh, and the two brothers that was with him. You can find that um, in the seventh episode, episode seven through twenty-one of the first season of Naruto. You know the whole land of waves and the the Naruto bridge and all that stuff. So I've created my own fictional background story uh, that I'll be revealing that I'll be posting on YouTube later on. So, you know, this is just fan-made, but I just, I, I, even though this is just for fun, but I do pride myself on not copying anyone, and especially uh, proving that I'm not, that uh, I was the, if I am the first person to come up with the concept, I'll post it on YouTube. The time, the date, everything. That, uh, I want to make sure that I'm original. So far, I don't see any signs that represents my village. Rock, I'm starting from the bottom up, rock, unknown. Hydens, Hydens, I don't even know what that means. Rock, star, moon, snow, rain, mist, waterfall, sand, grass, leaf, sound, smoke, club. Hydens is the, is the uh, hot uh, steam. This is, whoever did that didn't do it correctly. Those th those three squiggly lines is uh, uh, hot spring hot spring ninja from the uh, uh, village hidden in the hot spring. So they <laughs> they messed up there. The the Hydens is I believe is that dude with the Grand Reaper the Shimigami, the one that can't die. He's part of the Akutsuki or Akutsuki, or however you say it. Let's move along. Nope. Nope, I don't see it. Here's other symbols. You have the mist one that's somewhat similar. Yeah, but none of these are... Uh... My symbols that I have created. Yeah, hot water right there. 
I don't know if hot water or hot springs are the one and the same. That's Haydn's village. And you know, there's some of there's some of these smaller villages that are that's not part of you have the main five villages and then you have like sub villages like the rain, um the land uh the village hidden in the smoke, the village hidden in the hot haze or hot haze, excuse me. Uh, the land of grass, the land of snow, stars, even sound. These are sub uh villages, ninja villages. Some some of them are kind of familiar and some of them I've never even seen before. That's all right. Let's look at the symbols here. From uh, top to bottom, you have the leaf village, mist, sand, cloud village, rain, uh, stone. It's actually called stone. And there's another village called uh, the village hidden in the rock. There's a, there's a mistranslation from uh, Japanese to English. A lot of people call it the rock village. It's actually the stone village, the Japanese translation. But translated from the, from the Japanese manga to the American show, for some reason they switched it around to a rock because there is a rock village. And for instance, there, there's also a, a, um, uh, the village hidden in the sand. Or, uh, excuse me, the, the land of sand. You have some villages that are kind of similar to each other. Well, anyways, uh, it's the village hidden in the stone from the land of uh, Earth. And then you have uh, the grass village, waterfall, sound, snow, star, uh, hot water. You have uh, the Uzumaki symbol, which is, uh, they come from uh, the village hidden in the whirlpool, which came before the leaf village. So there's a problem here. If uh, the Leaf Village was the first to be created, they kind of screwed up because the backstory of the Uzumakis is that they had a village of their own called, you know, the village hid in the whirlpool. And uh, they it was destroyed and they teamed up with uh, the Senju clan along with the Ochiya to form, this is afterwards, after their village was destroyed, to form the, uh, uh, the Leaf Village. And then you have uh, the Moon Village, the Craftsman Village, um, then from the very bottom to the left, I don't know what that is, but that the second one, the question mark, is the village hidden in the uh, hot haze. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. And the flame, I have no idea what that is. The one on the very bottom right is the village hidden in the uh, lock or keys. The land of keys and the village hidden in the lock. I believe that's how you call it. All right, it's pretty much the same thing. Let's, let's go back. Yeah, I'm just verifying, that's all. Making sure that no one has my symbol. That's the most important part. Okay, here's another one. Leaf, sand, sound, cloud, smoke. Nope, that's the wrong one. <laughs> See, I was just about to say that. Uh, some people think that question mark is the village hidden in the smoke. That's actually incorrect. That's uh, you. You could say it that way. That's like the nickname of it, but it's actually the village hidden in the hot haze. So. I'm being technical. Same thing with, uh, uh, let's go to, uh, to see, look, rock. You see what I'm talking about? The rock village. It's actually called the Stone Village. Now, I'm not like, I don't know everything about Naruto. I'm not one of those hardcore fans. But I would say I'm, I'm like, me, like half and half. But even some of the hardcore fans will call it the rock village, uh, and they won't correct themselves. So it's actually the Stone Village. Anyways, it really doesn't matter. Okay. Okay, see, look, uh, see the fog? You see that? The fog village? This, it's actually the mist village. It's not the fog. So that just goes to show you that they, there's two that's wrong. The smoke, it's actually the village hidden in the hot, uh, excuse me, um, hot haze or hot haze village. And the, the fog one is actually the mist village. So they kind of screwed up on that this twice. 
But you can call it that, though, if you want to. But it would be like a nickname. I'm talking about the proper name of it. Anyways. It's, uh... This is pretty cool. I've seen this before. Not only does it have the, the village symbols, but it's, it's got like a neat background. From uh, top left to right going down, you have the leaf, cloud, mist, you see? Rain, sand, sound, stone. See, look at that stone. Someone got it right. <laughs> stone, water. And then you have the fire village. Interesting. I've, I've seen that before. I, I don't recall seeing that in this show. I haven't seen every episode, especially the Baruto. I don't want to get started on that. I'm just not a fan of Baruto. A grass, moon. I don't know what that is. What is that? Hold on a second. Oni? Hmm. Snow, star, and the sun village. And the what village? I don't know what that is. Okay. Let's go back. And here's the rest of the villages. Like, you have the main villages and some of the sub-villages. And then you have some of the just obscure ones. Hot springs. You see, I, was, I, I said that before. Hot springs, but the other one said hot water. Now, that one I'm not sure. It's either hot springs village, hot water village, or... Or what? I don't, I don't know. But at least I'm in, you know, at least I'm admitting I don't know something. Hidden Sound Village, maybe you guys could uh, comment below, figure out what that is. What's the proper original Japanese name? Or, you know, the proper translation from Japanese to English. You have Hidden Grass, Waterfall, Rain, you know, I've said it before. Village, Hidden Rock, there's another one, Rock, got it wrong. Because it, it's now this one is it's more important because there's another village called the Rock Village, the the Hidden Rock Village. So it's important that this one is called the Hidden Stone Village because that's one of the main five. Hidden Cloud, Hidden Mist. You see Hidden Mist again. He got it right on that one. Not the Hidden Fog, Hidden Mist. Hidden Whirlpool, Tides Village. You see, I was right on that one. Hidden Valley. You see, Hidden Stone. You guys see what I'm talking about? This is the Hidden Stone Village. So where's 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 the other one? That should be Hidden Rock, and that should be Hidden... Uh, excuse me. That should be Hidden Stone, and that should be Hidden Rock, but, you know, it is what it is. I'm, I'm pretty confident that I got that right. Frost Country, Snow, Hidden Star, Heat Haze. Are you sure? Heat haze. And the question mark is a small... Maybe I was wrong on that one. Heat haze village. Craftsman village. I was right on the sky village. Lock village. Red bean country. These are just countries. Pink, pink flower village. <laughs> Who wants to be a part of that, right? <laughs> Noodle country, vegetable country, these are just countries. Sea country, bird country, tea country, wave country, that's the land of waves. Valley country, stone country, and hidden haze. You see, they messed up here. See, I was right. It's hidden haze, and whatever that is, uh, that must be the symbol of the, the land, but it... Not not the village. You know, because you have the village symbol and then you have the land symbol. So this is the head and haze symbol on the bottom right, not the smoke. And this one that the full name of it is um I believe the land is called Devil's Heat Haze Village. I believe it's called. I could be wrong. Anyways. No symbol of mine here.
No. Let's go back. Let's uh, scroll down. So far, I don't see any. Uh, I don't see any of my symbols here. Let's put uh, water symbols to be spe uh, specific, because tsunami is water based. I don't see it, guys. This is just a ver uh, verification that uh, my symbol is unique. This is the closest thing that you can find, but it's the Miss Village. My, my symbol is different. Let's, let's see them all. I guess that's it. Well, let me put my symbol specifically. Let's do it specifically. See what happens. There it is. That's my symbol. Let's see what we find. Nope. Nothing. You're not going to find anything. All right. So I think I've declared that I'm the first person to come up with that symbol. That's my symbol. Okay? I'm the first. That symbol represents tidal wave or tsunami. There you go. All right.